Okay people, it's Tuesday, 30th of January, it's t 10 minutes past 8-ish. Uh, I've got a <coughs> I've been on the plot, we've had a very hard frost, and I just want to show you the current temperature. We're looking at what looks like minus 3 degrees. So, looking uh, great. As far as I'm concerned, I'm praying for a good ground frost and uh, manage to get one. Just hope it lasts for a few weeks. Break up that soil. Uh, that's it really, beautiful clear sky, apart from the chemtrails. Uh, just going to go leaf littering for an hour and then I'll be back digging up. Well, this is um, what I've collected so far, a few hundred weight of leaf mould, leaf litter. That will end up getting dug in to my lovely beds and that's the state of play at the moment but um yeah, it's a beautifully crisp, crisp beautifully crisp morning we've got a bit of wildlife the magpie one two uh, not quick enough there. And that's the morning. Good to be alive. Okay, we'll catch you later. Okay, I'm back at Leaflitter Central. A little, uh, it's a little area off the main road, junction. Here, yeah, busy road. At this time of day, anyway. That's uh, Chestnut Drive. This is where I am. Already had a clear up. I think that was Sunday. Still a bit to pick up. Waste not, want not. I'll give this a rake. And well, I've probably got an hour's worth of raking, maybe two journeys. There's a bit here. I'll go as far as I can. Do my bit for the community and the ecosystem. That's it, really. Okay, leaf litter central. Okay, back on the allotment <clears throat> after my leaf foray. It's about half nine now. I've been sat down for 20 minutes having a brew and a butty. And so I was around about an hour away from the site. The current temperature is it's up to about a degree and a half above. So we've had a an increase of four to five degrees which is pretty okay <sighs> breath is frosty I'm just gonna do a quick uh, show of my leaf collection I'll set this tripod up and Let's empty out. Thank you. 
very well compact. Has that come out? I think it possibly has. from that little area. This is it's quite tough somewhere. Good stuff. Got some worms in it. Little friends. Shitty brown gold. Okay, so that's sort of leaf litter and some of it is it's got to be a few years old because I don't think the council clear that area so some of the stuff at the bottom has been decomposed to a mould or a leaf compost I'll need to investigate differences but um, that's that that's leaf litter. Hopefully it'll break up the soil a bit, or the clay. Okay, I can get some more then. Brown gold. Shitty brown gold. Okay, just a quickie, it's about 20 past 11 and all is well. Site's been left, there's a few branches there, we might come back for them. Well, that's it, all leafed out, all leafed up and it's been quite an experience. I've met quite a few people, that's why it's taken so long. And had a jolly good chat as I like to do. So that's, that's this area cleared. Okay. Okay, it's quarter past twelve ish. That's currently at fifteen degrees now, so that's in full sun, mind. 15-ish. Okie doke. 
I've just got my last amount of leaf litter delivered by hand um, with a barrow it's got a flat tire I'm just gonna empty it out see what we've got and I think that'll be it for the day apart from a little bit of digging That's pretty much it. I've got a barrel load there. It's going to go up the end. And Okay, I'm just going to do a little demo of what I'm doing with these leaves. Now, uh, the problem with compact leaves like these is there's no there's no space in between, so you don't get breaking down. These are probably quite old. These what they actually need is to to be broken down. They need space in between, so they need to be separated and the way I'm just going to go about it is I'm just going to go through, I'm doing this one handed just for demo but um, I'll just keep turning them over over time I don't mind if they dry out that way they should be easier to separate and and then I'm just sparsely about an inch worth of inch to two inches worth of um, leaf litter right on the top aerated and it's just single dug over starting from this end as, as a normal dig would be I'm not going to do it now because I'm like to say it was one handed that's what I'm doing Okay, that's the preparation I'm doing. If it's right, good on me. If it's wrong, tough. It's already started. And I can't go and pick them all out. But they are they are sort of separated individually leaves and there are quite a lot of worms contained within this leaf litter. So hopefully they'll get to work on my soil. Okay, go. That's that. Okay, it's currently about twenty to three. 
in the afternoon. There's spots of rain in the air. What I've actually done is I'll tell you the temperature at the moment is whatever that says. It looks as though it's around about difficult that about eight degrees eight and a half eight and a half degrees okay I've fluffed up the leaf litter is under there I'll dry it out it's under there as well it's a huge great lump of leaf litterage and I managed to do one row of digging along here and then I furnish the surface with leaf litter and that's it really but I've got enough leaf litter now to just crack on with digging really and, and that's it the end of my day on the plotment knock it out thanks for watching if you watched this far cheers now